Texas is lined up for the opening kickoff. So here we go. Excellent kick. The Bulldogs and their ground game's always been sensational. It's not always one guy, Herbie. Sometimes they've got two or three that can carry the load. And that's what makes it so tough for this defense is you're not focusing in on just one guy. You're focusing in on really an entire scheme. And because of that diversity, I think it makes it more of a challenge. And you've got to be better tacklers in the open field. Throws it into coverage, and it's intercepted. And down he goes at about the 41. Good job to pick that ball off. He did a great job at getting in that passing lane and coming away with the ball. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 41. Tries to thread the needle. It's picked off. He came up with a fantastic interception there. Well, you know the quarterback is kicking himself for that one. He just made the wrong read. yard line first down they come out in a five wide set and he's hit before he can go anywhere yeah the defense looked a little sluggish there they can do better than that there are five wide receivers split out the quarterback in the gun Quick strike to the receiver. When you can move the ball downfield in big chunks like that, you've got the defense right where you want it. And a quick throw. And he's taken down around the 21-yard line. I'll tell you what, this defense better start to get pressure on the quarterback. They're giving him way too much time back there to throw the football. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. Tackle at the five-yard line. That's good for a game of 16 yards. That makes it first and goal. Mike three! Mike three! Looks to a receiver. Touchdown! Found his receiver for the score. And the closer you get to the end zone, the more difficult it becomes to throw the football because the field becomes much smaller to work with. But they did a very nice job there to come up with the touchdown. He makes the PAT. A five-play, 69-yard drive, and that's good for a touchdown. This quarterback has really demonstrated a tremendous amount of ability and leadership today. I'd be very surprised if he didn't continue to play well. So our score. 7-0. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You never like to have to play from behind, but a deficit this manageable shouldn't be in the front of their minds. They just need to go out there and play. They come out on an empty backfield. Quick out to his receiver. Brought down at the 40. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Hey, kill, kill, kill. Throws it, watch out. Oh, almost had a pick. That was a nice play. Anything you can do without being penalized to prevent the offense from moving forward is always a plus. From their own 40-yard line, it's second down. He fights forward to about the 40. The running back gets a yard, maybe less. And that was the freshman corner that got in there and made that tackle. Kill, kill, kill! He's gonna go for the home run. Incomplete, it's knocked down by the defense. Smart play, being ready for the pass and swatting it away. That'll make it fourth and 10. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. 
Mississippi State showing no fear early in this football game, Kirk, and they're looking for the upset. They are looking for the upset. And the longer they stick around in a game like this, I think the more that they believe they can actually pull it off. It looks like they, we may have ourselves a ball game today. The offense really came up with a nice drive there last time out, and most of those yards came through the air. This defense needs to improve from front to back. The line needs to put more pressure on the quarterback, and the defensive backs need to stick it to these receivers with tighter coverage. Mississippi State is up seven. Throws it in a hurry. He's tackled right around the 44-yard line. And off, and he's met in the backfield. They couldn't get back to the line of scrimmage on that one. Well, I don't think they did a very good job of selling the pass. The defense was able to read the play and come right in there and make a nice stop. It's second and 11. Ball on the 43. I think the quarterback that time didn't even see the linebacker. I think he was so focused downfield trying to read the safeties in the secondary that by the time he came to his receiver that was being guarded by the linebacker, I don't think he saw him. The linebacker made a good play to be able to knock that ball away. That's a great tackle at the 35. That makes it fourth and one. After the sack, it's now fourth and long. The punting team's got to give their kicker some time. He gets hit out of bounds at the 34-yard line. The Bulldogs have found a way to shut this offense down, but hey, it's still early in a football game. Yeah, give them a lot of credit for the way they've played up to this point, but just based on watching these teams and preparing for this game, do not be surprised to see this offense eventually find itself and start to execute much better. They'll bring him down around the 30-yard line. the loss of four yards on the play. From their own 30-yard line. Second down. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. Fires out to his receiver. And they make the stop at the 40-yard line. They'll spread the field with five wide. Now he tries to buy some time. He's at midfield, and he tackles him hard at the 46. A good quarterback knows when and how to improvise. And if he's got the skills, he can also turn a scramble into something big. Gets it out quickly, and he's shoved out of bounds at the 37. The sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set. On the throw, incomplete pass. There's a flag down on the field, and I'm betting that this one is pass interference. Defense. But you want your guys to be aggressive defending the pass, but penalties like this can be a real negative. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 22-yard line. Mike 50, Mike 50. He fights forward to about the 19. Call it again, three yards. That'll make it second to seven. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Good discipline here by the defense, stringing the option out and plugging the running lanes. That moved him back. From the 17-yard line, second down. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Hey, kill, kill, kill! 
Black. Fires it out, and he's tackled at the six. Quick throw, tight end, touchdown. And that one worked just like they draw it up, Kirk. Yeah, Brad, you're exactly right. Offensive line did a good job of protecting the quarterback. Good route by the receivers. Results, touchdown. Will be tied with the extra point. And he hits the PAT. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. He just drills this one. And they can forget about returning this one. They've got to play with some focus and smarts here. They don't want to make a mistake and suddenly find themselves trailing. He gets out to about the 37-yard line. Nice game for the halfback. That time they kept it on the ground with the counter play. The blocking was great up front, and the tailback was able to get into the open field and do some special things. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That's a game seven on the play. That makes it second and two. Gets out to around the 48. Gain of eight on the play. Here we go, here we go. Mike three, Mike three. Combo, combo, combo. They try him again, and this time they've got him in the backfield. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. Gets to about the 47-yard line. Fires out quickly to the tailback. Knocked out of bounds at the 42. We played one quarter. We're even at seven in this one. Back to the action now here in the second quarter. He's going to try to cough and corner this one. Gets it away. Wait a minute. He's going to throw. And this play is number eight on the drive. Four down, four down. Mike three. Mike three. Dog four. Pitch. He's knocked out of bounds at the 27-yard line. Caught open field. He's taken down around the 18-yard line. That's a deep nine on the play. That makes it first and ten. Run, left side. And he carries the ball for a nice game. Here's a little draw play. Nice run, and he's brought down. made at the 14. It's fourth down. So the field goal unit is on the field. They'll try for three points. Mississippi State is looking to go up by three. He gets it up, and they tack on three points. They line up to kick this one away. And he got all of this one. Great kick. 
And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. I think this defense has played well enough to be able to win this game, obviously. But at some point, you'd love to see their own offense feed off of some of the confidence that their defense is playing with. Because up to this point, the defense is keeping them in the game. But the offense isn't quite doing enough to be able to build on that lead. Quick throw. And they push him out right around the 28-yard line. He's finally shoved out at the 40-yard line. Fires quickly, and he's got his man. And down he goes around the 34-yard line. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. And he's taken down at the 23-yard line. They go to the back, and he's hit immediately in the backfield. Nothing doing on the halfback draw. That'll bring up second and 11. He scrambled. And he is drilled at the 18. That's a gain of five on the play. That'll make it third and five. Third and five coming up. Ball on the 18 yard line. And he's level at the four yard line. Touchdown, Longhorns. And he converts the extra point. An eight-play, 74-yard drive, and it results in a touchdown. An amazing drive for this offense. Outstanding execution. If you're the defense, you've got to do something to try to change things up to get this quarterback out of center. The score now, 14-10. Sends it sailing downfield. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. There's a strike complete, and he's immediately tackled. Number 23 on the tackle at the 32-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. Here we go! Green on Eagle! Eagle! He steps out at the 35-yard line. Gain of three on the play. From their own 35-yard line. First down. Four down, four down. Mike, three. Let's go. And he throws it away. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Excellent open field tackle. Slings it. It's first and ten. Ball on the 18. 
A nice looking play that time. Well, the defense was blitzing here, and again, great recognition by the quarterback to find the hot receiver. He fights forward to about the 16. Mississippi State's going to have to use their second time out of the half. This is the eighth play of this drive. They'll knock him down for a loss. Third and 11. Ball on the 19. Quick throw to the tight end. Brought down around the nine-yard line. Wow, a long game, but still not enough for the first. Well, the offense hurt themselves by digging themselves into a hole on first and second down. So the defense didn't really have to put too much thought in how to defend on that third down. And the offense isn't successful on fourth down. The defense had that option play snuffed out from the get-go. Momentum swings have been fairly even. And with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Texas holds a four-point lead. Brought down after a nice run up the middle. So we've played two quarters. The Longhorns lead 14-10. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Chris Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. A tight, hard-hitting, low-scoring affair. Great hey, affair. This, this Great. Is right, you can say it like it is. This is right in your wheelhouse, Pollock. I mean, this this is exactly in your comfort zone. No, I, absolutely. I mean, you like to see people flying around. You like to see defenses dictating to offenses and make them play on our terms. And it's it's fun to watch. It's something that as a great every great defense prides themselves prides themselves on tackling. You know, you didn't see very many missed tackles in the first half that led to big plays. And try to limit those big plays. And when they do get down towards the red zone, make people kick field goals. And that's that's how you see dominant defenses year in and year out. And, and that's what we're seeing today. We've done what we can do here at halftime. Time to get you back out to the second half. We'll keep an eye on everything going on in college football. Brad Nestler and Kirk Herbstreit ready with a call. All right, Reese and David, welcome back, everybody. Just about set to start the second half. He really got a hold of that kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Here comes the offense as they look to find the end zone yet again. Texas is up four. He gets rid of this one. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on their own 25. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. Steps out of bounds at the 28 yard line. That makes it third and seven. They come out in a five wide set. Quick out to his receiver. He's at midfield. 
They'll bring him down at about the 33 yard line. three yard line it's second down they'll line up with five wide receivers here's the throw and I don't think he got anything on that They'll spread the field with five wide. Fires a bullet out to the right, and this one falls incomplete. Second down and ten to go. All on the 19-yard line. Texas is up by four. Red two, go! Green eight, Goes to the end zone. Hauls it in as he's pushed out of bounds. Touchdown, Texas! John was finding the space to run and just bursting in for six. And he adds the extra point. Looks like they're ready for the kick. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. Here's the halfback. Runs it right. Nice pickup. That makes it second and six. Zips it to the tight end, and he's tackled right away. Call it a game of 12 yards. First down. Ready! He's at midfield. He's at the 40. And they tackle him at the 34. That always stings the defense to give up a big running play like that. They don't want to give up big chunks of yards on the ground. Makes it to the 24. That's good for the game of 10 yards. That makes it first and 10. And he's tackled around the 21 yard line. That's good for the game of 10 yards. That'll make it second and seven. They'll work the right side, and he tackles him hard at the 18-yard line. They're about four yards away here on third down. Big play, and it's first and goal. That's a game for the That makes it first and goal. And a nice move to finish it off. Touchdown. Oh, 
He makes the PAT. And it looks like they're ready for the kickoff. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And they can forget about returning this one. The Bulldogs have really surprised everybody in this football game. They have not been intimidated at all, which is great to see. The attitude and effort of this team has put them in a position where they got a shot to win this game here in the second half. I was really impressed with their last series. They came out with a focus on the passing game, and the offense got the job done. We'll see if they have the same strategy here. Makes it out to about the 33. Texas holds a four-point lead. Fires out to his wideout. Tries to buy some time. He's taken down at the 45 yard line. So that sack leaves them a little ways to go here. It's third down and 13. Three down, three down. Mike 50, Mike 50. Red, two, blue, four. That's a great tackle at the 43. That makes it fourth and long. And we see this offense again after what you, Kirk, called a very physical touchdown drive. Well, I say that, Brad, because the big hog mollies up front were able to create holes for the running game, and it helped them get the score. Let's see if they can do it again. Gets to around the 42. That's good for the game. First down. Again, he'll get the call. Tackle made at the 44. So the halfback gets only two on the draw play. That brings up second to nine. And down he goes at the 47 yard line. Number 17 on the touchdown at the 47 yard line. Him hard at the 49. That's good for a game of two yards. That makes it fourth and four. And this one is a beauty. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. So now both teams come trotting back out onto the field. Texas is up four. Makes it out to about the 30. Got it, but he's going to lose yards here. End of the third, and we've got a tight one. 21-17, Texas. Well, this final few minutes is going to determine this one. Tight ball game, 
Action set to start here in the fourth quarter. Red two. You've got to wonder here, early in the fourth quarter, if that stop and a play like that might be the momentum swing this team needs to win it. That'll make it fourth and six. It's away, and it's a booming punt. He's taken down at the 33-yard line. This is a pretty crucial series right here. With things being so tight, your best players have to step it up on both sides of the ball. It's the tailback looking for the corner. He makes his way to about the 45. He's on the run. And he's taken down at the 35. First down. Three down, three down. Mike three. Mike three. Here we go. Quick strike to the receiver. Tackle at about the 13. And he carries the ball for a nice game. That's good to have a That brings a second and They'll drop in for a loss. Makes the catch and look out. Drop down right around the four yard line. Fourth down, and the offense is still on the field. All day, every day, any day. Mike three. Mike three. Wide 80. Wide 80. Motion, motion, motion. Pass incomplete, trying to get it to his receiver. And that was a big stop defensively. Yeah, they only needed a few yards here to keep the drive alive. Great job by the defense to shut him down. Things aren't tied, but they might as well be. It's this drive that could really dictate the tone for the last quarter. Texas is up by four. And he is drilled at the seven. Mississippi State just took their first time out. This guy is one of the most reliable receivers around. They needed a big play on third down, and he got it for them. Oh, and he can't hang on. Huge drop there. So they run the same pass play again. Yeah, typically you'll see this when teams are having success with a particular player. They feel confident about a play's chances. 
So it's second and ten. Ball on the 20 yard line. And he just gets rid of it. You know, when you feel pressure like that, the worst thing you want to do is just to throw the ball into coverage. He got away with one right there. He's very fortunate. Next time, he should just throw it away out of bounds. Just over two minutes in the game. And they bring him down for a sack on the play. Mississippi State's going to have to use their second time out of the half. Two minutes left in the ball game. They get this one off, and it's a beauty. He makes it to the 48-yard line. The Bulldogs coaching staff and the entire team knows that this is the guy that can win it for them. The offense has to find a way to get the football into the hands of this running back, whether it's a simple toss sweep or maybe a ball out of the backfield where he can catch it in space. Any way that they can get the football to him to see if he can spring one to maybe get the field goal range or who knows, maybe take it to the house. There's a strike complete. He's tackled the 39-yard line. Number three makes the set at the 39-yard line. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Makes the grab and steps out right away. That makes it first and ten. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 18. Five wide. Mike three. Set. Wide 80. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. Nice play to set up first and goal. Mike three. That makes it first and goal. Scrambling around. Touchdown, and that's going to give him the lead.
Penalty so the kicker Jones will line up here and try to give his team a three-point lead with this extra point. Offices. Penalty markers down. They took too much time. Just over a minute left. And he converts the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. Sends it sailing downfield. The Longhorns were really mistaken if they looked at this game as a gimmick. Well, they've been in a dogfight the entire ball game. Let's see what they can do with this final drive. They still have time here to be able to pull out and try to get a win. Late in the fourth quarter in a one-possession game, and poise is what it's all about here. Who's going to have it and who won't? Quarterback all by himself in the backfield with five wideouts. Decides to tuck it in, and he's got space. They'll bring him down at about the 35. That's a team of ten. They come out in a five-wide set. Throws incomplete, intended for his wideouts. This quarterback needs to be careful not to use his arm strength to try to force things, because that's when mistakes happen. It's third down, and they're about the length of the football away from the first down marker. Well, a lot of frustration by that offense, but you've got to give the defense credit for coming up with a stop in this quarter in a game this close. He's looking for his man. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. From the 48-yard line, it's first down. Quick throw, and they make the stop at about the 45. The Longhorns will use their first time out of the half. Under a minute left. He's knocked out of bounds at the 40-yard line. Pretty nice pickup here. These guys are getting very tight on their timing. It's third down, and they're about two yards shy of the sticks. He's tackled at the 34-yard line. Texas will take their second time out of the half. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Spikes the ball. Short yardage situation here. It's third and one. Four down, four down. Mike's 50, they come out on an empty backfield. Black and he's hit immediately.
Looks like they didn't get the playoff quick enough. Delay of game, offense. Texas is up a field goal. He splits the uprights with the extra point. And with time winding down, they probably won't let this return man field the ball. Nice kick, plenty of distance. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. Time's running short here, so let's see what plays out. Not much time to be creative here. They've got to get the ball into the end zone. And he's level at the 32. Number 23 brings him down at the 32-yard line. And he stops the clock with a spike. That makes his early three. Third down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. One last play, folks. It's time to find out how far he can throw it and see if this game becomes one of the all-time greatest. Here we go. He airs it out. It's picked off, and it's the sophomore. That's a great tackle at the 15. That's going to do it for this one. Our final score, 28-24, Texas. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler saying thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.